Hello, I'm Mark, the director and naval historian behind This Is My Battleship. For me, battleships are a passion. Ever since I was a young child visiting them in Navy days, through the time when I joined the Royal Navy and served as a weapons engineer, and now as a filmmaker, anything to do with the Navy, the sea and warships are a lifeblood to me. Stepping aboard USS Iowa for the first time, I was instantly transported back to that 12-year-old stepping aboard his first big gun warship. The smell in particular took me immediately there. Each ship has a unique sense of personality, sense of smell, sense of the crew. While Mark and I were researching the story of the Iowa, we came across a lot of um, smaller and bigger and quite moving stories of the veterans that worked on the ship. And uh, that personal approach to a story that's usually military-based for most people was the most interesting part for myself. So I thought it would be interesting for people like me that are not connected to that world to be part of making a film that shows the personal side of the macrocosmos around a ship when people live together like it's almost like a village. I think the USS Iowa is very important for future generations because they will have no other way of stepping aboard the ship and seeing the size of it, being in awe of it. And I, I know the first time I take my boys on that ship, that's what they're going to be doing. They're going to be looking up at it and going, wow, it is so big. And then they'll start to realize that people lived here and that their work involved sitting at stations and manning guns and all sorts of things that made this town, which is actually you know, a battleship, is a floating town of people and we're going to tell those stories that bring it alive through the guys who are still with us, thankfully, and can say, this is what it was like, this is where I worked on this battleship, this was my place. Oh, when we started interviewing some of the veterans, it became interesting to see that um, all of them really enjoyed telling their story and all of them were drawn back into the past and um, got very emotional but also very sharing about their story. It's like they wanted to share this little world that nobody sees with the rest of the world. So we got deeper and deeper into it um, until we decided to make a feature lens documentary about the subject. One of the first things the Founding Fathers did was to found the US Navy. The tradition of the American Navy stretches from warships like USS Constitution through USS Iowa and now to ships like USS Freedom and Independence. Each one of those ships has an important place in naval history. Each one of those ships has battle honours. Each one of those ships has lives and crew stories to be told. USS Iowa was the last fast big gun battleship of the Navy. She served from 1943 up to 1990. Her story is unique in the Navy for a ship to serve that long. We appreciate now that time is running out for the World War II veterans. We fear there won't be that many with us for that much longer we need to record their stories. What it was like supporting the Marines at Okinawa. What it was like steaming across the North Atlantic on a battleship hunt. Then there was the Korean War. What was it like supporting the troops going ashore at Incheon? And the more modern crew, times in the Gulf. What must it have been like in the heat with a ship with no air conditioning? How did they survive? To me, all of those stories are unique and fascinating and each one is worth telling. Because each story brings us a sense of who the crew were, what it was like to live back then. And it also gives us a way of looking at the future. If 2,000 people can survive in a tiny space, then we can get along as people with our neighbors. That I think is one of the key things about this film, is how the crew lived as a family and how they brought that life to the ship. So you've met the filmmakers, you've watched the trailer, what we need now is your support for this film. If you have a story to tell about USS Iowa, we would love to hear it. If you can contribute financially, that would be fantastic. This is your chance to become part of This Is My Battleship.